So, my voice is for the most part back to normal. Um, so, this was just kind of like, I had no idea what to do, so I'm like, it's raining, and it's been raining for, like, 30 hours straight, so I'm just gonna draw people walking under an umbrella in the rain. It's a really crappy umbrella, too. I'm probably getting really wet. I'm sorry, I don't know what was with my voice just there, that was weird. Of course, I don't even know how that'll pick up on the mic. That just sounded weird in my head. My, uh, my shoddy anatomy. This is 
I don't remember what day this is. It's one of the days of the week. How about that? Um. So, this was kind of... This, this came about... I was watching... Slash... Well, more listening than watching. Um. While I drew it. But, uh, another YouTube artist, uh, Caitlin McKaig. She does, uh, creatures and monster mashups a lot. Um, and I was watching, uh, one of her monster mashups. So, like, she had created this, like, dragon thing. She likes dragons, so she draws dragons a lot. Um, so I was like, okay, yeah, I can do that. So that's where this came from. Um, I was tempted to just take the time and put scales everywhere, and then I'm like, no. So he just kind of has, like, a mask of scales. <laughs> um. I don't draw serpents very often, so I just kind of guess on how everything works. One of the things I should probably say, I don't think I've said it in any of the other Doodle videos, but for, I don't use references for any of uh, the Doodles that I do. It's just, it's straight out of my head. Um, because that's that's just what it's supposed to be in my mind. That's That's what a Doodle is. It's just something from your head put directly on paper without any kind of guide, I suppose. So, but yes, I'm quite happy with how he turned out. He's kind of, in a weird way, cute, I guess. I don't know. Not correctly proportioned in his neck, but um, I just I had no inspiration. I was see, I just I kind of wanted to get the doodle done so that I could get working on the actual project that I'm in the middle of right now, which is um my uh piece for uh the monthly challenge that uh Jazza from Draw with Jazza does um. It was like, I had just started working on it the day before, I believe, and it's like, I just, I wanted to work on it more, and so I was, like, thinking about that. I was like, okay, I have to do this, I have to do this, and then it was just like, I had no idea what to do, so it just became that little half-assed doodle thing of the kid dreaming about being on a ship. Um, it, <clears throat> the same problem here, honestly. I just, I wanted to work on the competition piece, but I had to do the doodle. Uh, so I just started scribbling. It sort of turned into something. I did actually end up spending like 18 minutes on this. But, um, yeah. I don't even know. Well, I know what it is. It's just, it's kind of... Um, half-assed. <laughs> of course, most of these doodles are half-assed. I was trying to make it look like rock, and it, it, yeah, it didn't work very well. My water kind of looks good, though. Right? Right? No? Okay. I think one of the problems with my computer mic is I don't actually know where the mic is. I think if I knew where the mic is, it would I'd be able to get better sound quality, but I, I literally have no idea where the mic on my computer is. 
so I should probably try to figure that out. So, yep, this is my, um, uh, waterfall, sort of. So before I had said that I would take two of my favorite doodles every month at the end and turn them into full, you know, colored and finalized pictures. So this one of the cats and then this one of the, uh, the beach seascape thing are the ones that I decided that I would pick. I've actually already started on the seascape. Um... I've changed it around a little bit and actually started doing it traditionally, which I'll show you here. Um, I took the picture with my phone, so I apologize for the bad quality. You can uh, see the wolf up on the top there and then the bird and uh, there won't really be a beach, but that's the progress. So um, yeah, till next time.